Hi, Scorpio. We are at the I&M Canal today to do readings. Um, it is actually pretty hot out, so I am glistening just a bit. I have a very strange message for you, Scorpio. This has definitely got to be the strangest message I have ever been given to deliver, ever. Um, do not get offended by this, please. This is in no way meant in a derogatory manner. And only Scorpio will actually understand it. Understand that I have strong Scorpio placements, so I am not a hater, okay? Scorpio, you are being called upon to go within the waters and clean out the uh, the ickies, the parasites. You're being called to go within the waters and clean out the parasites. I don't know if, if that is Wow, and look what just came out. The dreamer. Embrace your true purpose. Begin a new adventure and trust yourself. You're being called to go into the waters and pull out that what is that which does not belong. And I don't think that this is only you. I think that it is for others as well. King of Spring, a financial windfall. Your leadership skills are needed now. An unexpected supporter for your cause. Scorpio, you are being called. You are being called. Let's see what we get in the angel deck. And then we're going to do your tarot. Oh, I didn't even say. Um... This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and wherever else you want to put it for the week of July 30th. Okay. Scorpio, you are definitely being called for something. Ace of Fire, an exciting new opportunity, career advancement, change your life now. Holy crap. You're being called. Page of Earth, good news about financial matters. Wanting to do something more challenging, a new area of study. You're being called, Scorpio. You're being called. On the bottom, we have balance. The need for balance and moderation. Cooperation and compromise. Waiting for the perfect timing. You're being called into a situation. Seven of Water, a complex decision, the need to do research, stop procrastinating. You know you're being called. <clears throat> Eight of Fire, events moving at a fast pace, delays are over, many things are happening at once. You're being called, Scorpio. The Moon, important psychic insights, events behind the scenes, this is where you come into place. Release fears that hold you back. You're being called, Scorpio. Do not fear this. It will be a self-fulfilling prophecy. I just cut the cards. I just cut the cards. Nine of air, expecting the worst. Self-fulfilling prophecies, sleepless nights. And what's on the other side? Ace of Fire, an exciting new opportunity, career advancement, change your life now. Oh, Scorpio, you're being called. That's like, oh, we have a card backwards in here. Why? What is this? Balance. The need for balance and moderation, cooperation, compromise, waiting for perfect timing. I don't know why it's backwards. Okay. Let's pull some tarot, shall we? Okay, for Scorpio, for the week of July 30th, a 
I see the tower and a page of pentacles. Don't know what that's about yet. Let's see if they come out, shall we? Scorpio? Moon card. Listen to your intuition. Emperor, take control. Do what you know you're supposed to do. But I feel this really good energy with it. Like, excited. And I just saw the full card in there. I just saw the, yep, yeah, I see the full card. Magician. The world, three in a row. The Hierophant, four in a row. Seven of Pentacles. All right, let's take a look, shall we? On the bottom of the deck, we have the Nine of Wands, Temperance, Two of Pentacles. Okay. Let's see what we got here. You're about ready to take that leap of faith. Because you understand that this is going to take more magic than what most people know. The world, it's going to bring in a new cycle. <coughs> the Hierophant. It's a higher calling. Seven of Pentacles, you're prepared. I don't know who this is resonating with. If this is you, please, uh, you know. <coughs> oh, you don't want to say. You do not want to say. You don't want to say it's you. Oh my goodness. And you're not going to say. All right, fair enough. New beginning. Magician. The world. Hierophant. Seven of Pentacles. This is going to be big, Scorpio. This is very exciting. I don't believe it's for me. But then again, you never know. Because I've been feeling a call too, so we shall see. Two of Pentacles, balance. Temperance. Holy crap. Did you see that beat? Look at this. What are they doing? Putting one into the other. This is a much higher calling. It's time to move on your higher calling now. I understand this message for me. You understand this message for you. It's time to move on this higher calling. I don't know if you can see this or not. Yeah. It's time for you to move on your higher calling now, Scorpio. Wow. Wow. You may be at page status with it. It's time to make that choice. It's time to look and see where to make that first step because this is everything and you're going to have victory and you're going to have wish fulfillment and you're going to be able to make the choices in every aspect that you want because the old you, the old way of doing things is over. Now you're balanced within yourself. King of Cups, balanced emotions, is, yep. Let me put these back and we'll give it another go, shall we? Don't get caught up in your Don't get caught up in your head over this. Just do it. Scorpio is now being called up to the plate to do something big. And there's one of you out there where this is going to be absolutely huge. And you know it's you. You know it's you. You know that I'm talking to you right now. You know what this is. 
you know how this is going to affect things. You know how this is going to affect your world, your life, and the world as a whole. You're going to have an effect. You understand the butterfly effect. The moon with the Ten of Wands. It's time to put down the burdens and walk into the unknown. It's time to put down all the burdens and walk into the unknown, Scorpio. It's time to fulfill that destiny. It's time to become you, who you're supposed to be now. It's time to put the work in. Because you've achieved seeing it from a different perspective. I see the tower peeking out. I see the tower peeking out. What's behind the tower? Four of swords. Conserve your energy. Come into balance with your higher self. Don't get confused. Don't get distracted. Seven of Cups with the Devil. Don't get confused or distracted either. You know what you're supposed to be doing, Scorpio. Exciting! Exciting! Alright, let's see what we got. One more shuffle for Scorpio. What else you got for Scorpio? Isn't it gorgeous here? I do love it. This wall is like a couple of hundred years old, I think. It's beautiful. This is your choice. It is your choice. The universe is saying it's your choice. But you are being called. You're being called for a higher purpose now. I'm really being drawn to the bird. Spirits coming in. Conserve your energy and meditate. Spirits coming in. You're going to get a download. Any questions you have are going to be answered. going to be surprised at where this actually takes you is what I'm getting you know your higher calling you don't know all of it you understand the butterfly effect but you're still seeing it in limited terms what you gonna do are you gonna hold on to the past you're going to hold on to the past self or are you going to let go? Take that leap of faith, maybe the biggest leap of faith of your life. It may be the biggest leap of faith in your life. Move forward with knowing who you are. Wow, Scorpio. Deep and heavy. Deep and heavy, baby. And for some reason, I didn't even realize I did it. Your first cards were set to the side. You needed to start and end with these. Full card. Magician. World. Hierophants, Seven of Pentacles. It's your choice, but you can do this if you want. You can make that change you've always wanted to. You can be who you always wanted to. You've been putting in the work. You're ready. Scorpio, congratulations. You're leveling up. Peace to you. You know I love you. Ciao. Bye.